Hello. In this example, I will show you how to input and check this T joint. So let's start with a new project. As you see, there is a predefined list of the wizards. I will use a 2D frame and this T joint wizard. Now the geometry is automatically prepared. Some default uh, cross sections are used. I will follow with uh, this input. Now I will only add some load effects. So let's here add uh, some bending moment and shear force. I will minus. Okay. Now let's continue with the definition, the okay, design and definition of uh, manufacturing operations. In this uh, example, I will use a template. So for uh, for these uh, basic uh, shapes, we have prepared a list of uh, templates. I will see that I can select from a predefined list. I will select this. Uh, template with a button by the now. Okay. Now, as you see, the uh, manufacturing operations uh, were automatically applied. Uh, the joint is uh, loaded, so now we can continue with the check of this joint. Let's start calculation. Now the calculation is started. Uh, we use a nonlinear uh, solver, so here you can see the, the progress of the, of the calculation, the number of iterations which are used. Yes, now the calculation is finished. So let me demonstrate you the uh, available results. We can of course uh, present the results directly in the 3D graphical view. So first let's start with the fine element analysis results. So first I will show you the equivalent stress. So here you can see the graphically the stresses in the whole joint. I will add the deformation so now you can see the same values on the deformed structure and what is also possible are the forces in the bolts so if I switch off on this possibility the, the bolts are automatically uh, the forces in the bolts are automatically uh, uh, displayed Okay, the next uh, possibility is the plastic strain. So if I change this uh, view, now you can see the most critical, the most critical uh, parts of the join. In this case, uh, um, it's the near to the uh, to the bolts uh, on, on the top of the joint. Okay. Uh, the next uh, group of the checks are the checks of the stress. So here we can see the graphically uh, the parts or, or check of the of the steel plates. That's the comparison of the stress in the structure to the allowed to yield strength of the of the steel. And what is more important is the strain check. What's the comparison of the strain to a allowed value, which is 5% according to the Euro code. Okay. Uh, this, of course, uh, the same. Uh, there is another possibility. Uh, we can present all results in the tables. So for that, we have these uh, tabs. 
First is the brief overview of uh, all items in the joint. So here you see that the analysis was correctly calculated. The mm, strain in the plates, stresses in the bolts and welds. If uh, I select the item plates, then we can of course go through the list of all plates uh, in the in the project. And as you see, there are uh, detailed outputs uh, of, uh, of the of the stresses and uh, of the directly in the uh, in the uh, in this this top view you can see the values in the graphical graphically presented uh, in, in the plates. Another available uh, items or the tab is for the bolts. So here is again the table with all bolts in the project. Uh, I can go through the list and control the values for each bolt. And the same, the same uh, presentation is for the welds. So here you can see again the list of the welds. In the top uh, you can see graphically the position of the weld in the structure on a plate. And what is really uh, interesting is uh, the graphical representation of the intensity and of the of the stresses, uh, equivalent stress in the weld. So that uh, were the, the results in the check. The last uh, item which I would like to talk about uh, now is uh, the report. So of course we can uh, generate the report with all uh, outputs uh, from the check uh, of the joint. We have three uh, levels, one line which is very brief, one page and the detailed. So I will show you the detailed one. Uh, now you see that the report is uh, generated. That's uh, the list of, uh, of all necessary values and uh, for about the joint. As you see this uh, quite long table. And of course it's also possible to add or switch off some item by this generator. So that's all about uh, this uh, joint. Thank you for attention.